Tom's pretty much a game of two halves, so first half very good, second half just about got away from us. You know, I've said, how many times have I said this? The work, the, the work ethic, the, the, the commitment, the attitude was all there, it's class, you know. Uh, I thought we were great in that first half. I thought the, the 10 minutes just after half time we, uh, we threw it away. Uh, you know, throwing the ball on the floor, you know. And we talked about it a couple of minutes before and said what we needed to do to make sure we got the, you know, the start of the second half good and, and, and we didn't. And that was the, the turning point of the game. You go in at 18-10 and then, you know, 10 minutes into the second half you, you, you're 2018 down. And then look, we, we scrap, we battle, we, we, we work really hard uh, and they scored two, two tries on, on the last play. So, you know, we, we again, we show a, a lot of resilience and a lot of, um, a lot of great stuff, but just knock off at important times in the game and, and they come back and hurt you when you're playing against a team that's sat second in the league. But, uh, you know, I've said it all season, uh, you know, we've, we've, um, we've had enough opportunities uh, to, to beat one of these top six teams and uh, just that quite did it and you know, I thought it was the start of the second half that, that blew us away uh, today. How important was the first 10 minutes of the second half because if we keep them out let's say they start taking a few chances and maybe more errors come from that maybe more unforced errors yeah, more chances. Yeah and, 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 and it's like a start of a game you reset you restart in the second half and uh, you know, we were in control, we got the first kick off and then threw it along the floor and knock on and then we're under the pump and then they get back to backs and you know again you know, we, it took us 79 minutes to get a, a repeat set today which is pretty remarkable when they had five or six so uh, six again sorry so uh, yeah um, we've got to look at ourselves we've got to look at you know the, the leaders and, and, and the decision makers to say why why is that just why we're lost in his head why we're lost in his composure and, and and getting rattled when um, you know it's a, the, the, the important time is, is the start of any game or start of the second half. Looking on more positive side of things, first half. I mean, there's sort of some of the tries. Ryan Johnson's try, for example, that goes to show what you what you're telling us every week, really, about how skillful these lads are. <laughs> and the play, and when the play they excite anybody, and, and you, you, everybody can see that. And I thought that. Uh, you know, we, we cut them up, we, we caused them problems, we ripped them apart, we moved them about and they just weren't clinical. And again, I'll go back to that, is that you know, got teams that are going to be in that top six, when they get a chance, bang, they nail it. And we just mm, don't, and, 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 and that's the difference. Uh, but yeah, I thought, I thought the first half were uh, full of vigour, full of um, passion. Uh, I thought we rattled them a little bit, we, we stood toe to toe with them. and. Uh, and they, they struggled with us, uh, so yeah, I thought that um, we were very good in that second half, uh, that first half, sorry, a little bit disappointed in the second half, but I want to say it again, I, I'm mostly proud of the work ethic, the, um, the commitment and uh, they never say die attitude that they've got. Before we move on to next week, I know you always go on about the Eagles Sport, uh, Sports Association Man of the Match, um, do you have any from out there today? Oh, they were playing it, but I thought Ryan Johnson was great, um, I thought Keel were good. You know, I thought uh, I thought Dougie was good as well. So there the, the, the were a, no, um, the a number of players that were, were great today, and, and you know, all of them, all of them are working hard and all that. But yeah, please do vote. <laughs> please do vote with the more voters. Uh, we want your opinions. We want you to be an active part of this um, this voting process. So uh, there's plenty of people there today that you can be immensely proud of from one to one to seventeen. But surely there's one that you like a little bit more. Give them the man of the match. And finally, Dewsbury Rams next uh, next Friday, last home game of the season, last game of the season. They should what they still can do against Bartley uh, on Premier Sports. They they took them down to the wire. Uh, they're not going to uh, they're going to go down trying, aren't they? Hundred percent. And, and look, Finney's got them got them working out for each other. Uh, I think he's got rid of some of the, the problems that he had, so he's got young people or young players that want to play and, and uh, I thought they were great against Batley the other day, so no, they're, they're going to certainly come here and, and want to finish their season before they get relegated with a bang. Uh, what we want to do is send our fans away with a, a smile on their face. Look, there's, there's the judiciary this week, my favourite place, um, and, 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 and Fats is up there, so you know, will we get a team out next week? Who knows? Because people want to suspend people for what? Um, for what? <laughs> you know, uh, 
so yeah, it's gonna it's a tough week, uh, but we need to finish on a high. And you know, I still think that we're in control of that. that whether we finish seventh, and that's been the same since we realised we we couldn't finish in the top six. We want to finish seventh, and then we can sign off with the you know a relatively um, progressive season. Um, so yeah. All, all hands on deck, there's a few bus and bodies in there. Uh, but I'm sure they'll all pack themselves up and be ready for next week. Just, hey, have a little prayer for, for Thax uh, that he, he can come away with no games because uh, it'd be a sad end to his career, wouldn't it?